Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to set up a HomePod Mini fast and easily. This will be a full tutorial, so let's get right into the video. As you can see right here, I have a HomePod Mini and I have one of my old phones that I'm going to be using to set it up. The first thing that you want to do is plug in your HomePod Mini to your electrical outlet. So I've plugged it in and you're going to have to give it a few moments to boot up, okay? Now you want to make sure that your iPhone is up to date, okay? That your iOS is up to date. I've just updated this recently, so I know I'm good to go. And essentially when it's ready to be paired up, okay? Okay, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to unlock your phone and bring it relatively close to the HomePod Mini and then it's going to recognize it and give you the opportunity to actually pair it. So right now it just made a sound and it's doing this little uh, motion right here with the light which means it's ready to be paired. So I'm going to go ahead, we're going to open this up. I just created this little quick passcode just to keep it simple. As you can see right here, it recognized the HomePod Mini and we're going to click Setup. So I'm going to click Setup right there. Where is it? Uh, in the kitchen. I'm just gonna put in the kitchen because that's where we are right now. So in the kitchen continue Okay speakers. Do I want to use as a stereo pair? No, I only have one HomePod mini So I'm just gonna use it uh, by itself. Okay, not now personal requests So it's saying uh, do you want to set it up to allow you to have personal requests? That's completely up to you um, I'm gonna put don't use personal requests and I'm gonna cover it. I'm gonna be covering up my uh, Personal information over here in a moment. I don't know when it's gonna pop up location services. Okay, so it didn't pop up yet. Uh, do you want to turn on location services? It's up to you. I'm going to click not now just to keep it nice and quick. Okay, not now. Uh, Siri on HomePod. Uh, so yeah, once again, my information is not there yet. I can talk to Siri by talking to the HomePod saying like, hey, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to say it because I don't want to set off your devices. Um, so you can you can choose to, to, to do it or not. I'm just going to continue right now. Okay, just like that. Account and settings. I don't know if my information is here. I believe, yeah, it is here. So I'm going to keep it covered over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and bring my phone off the screen right here. And it's just saying that I want to use my iCloud account to transfer over um, all of my settings and stuff. Sorry about that. I just did a workout, so my hand is kind of shaky. Uh, but I'm going to click transfer over. Okay, so once again. So basically... It would just, that last screen just asked me if I want to transfer all of my account settings, Wi-Fi, blah, 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 transferred over. So in order to um, pair this up now, what I need to do is just get this little flashing symbol in the in the camera screen right over here. And, and uh, it worked over there. Sorry about that. I should have had a glass of water before I started this video. I'm speaking so fast. But I wanted to get through it quickly because I want to show you how fast it is to set up. So now it says setting up. And in just a few moments, it will be completely paired up and set up and good to go, ready to be used. So the only thing is, like I said, I covered all my account information um, um, before, just, uh, you know, not like not a huge deal anyways, but I just wanted to cover it up. So as you can see right here, HomePod Mini setting up. It usually doesn't take long. This is my old iPhone 7. So right now I'm using an iPhone 12 on a daily basis. So this is a little bit slower. I'm sure if you're using a modern iPhone, um, it's going to be a little bit faster. But I mean, that's it. I mean, you don't really have to watch this. When it's done, it's just going to say it's set up. So I'm going to place the phone down. I think we're good to go. Um, you know, once you've done this step, it's going to say setting up and it's going to finish. Um, and it'll just say you're good to go. So, like I said, you don't need to wait for this. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And, of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.